Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is a good day. Why do you ask? Well, first of all, I get to open my BoxyCharm and my APC, which is always fun. Then today is also Friday, and I get to go on a girls weekend without kids. And lastly, I like my hair today. And I know that some of you are like, it's kind of a minor thing, but for me it's a big deal because my hair has been pretty much the same for a couple of years now. And I just haven't had the heart to chop it all off. I usually either chop it really short or keep it really long. And I haven't felt ready to cut it yet. But I knew that I wanted to do something different. Every time I cut my bangs, I regret it. So I was like, what can I do that would be different, but not something super drastic. So I decided to two part my hair down the middle instead of on the side, which is what I normally do. And I actually love it. Like I feel like my hair looks more full and healthy. I know that's really bizarre, but I think part of it is I have all of these like tiny little wispy hairs over here. And when I part my hair over far on the side, like you really see those tiny wispy hairs and they look like really broken and fried and unhealthy. So anyways, all of those things together, today is a good day. Plus, I do love this blue eyeshadow. I don't normally wear blue eyeshadow, but I was feeling it today. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started on this unboxing stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and open my Ipsy bag first because I usually do. All right, so the first thing in the Ipsy bag is this cute little card. It says Ipsy Rock Starlet on it. Let's check out the bag. Oh, that's cute. Ooh, and it's a really good bag too. It's very thick. Feels like good quality too, which is really nice. It's got this cute little mascara, makeup palette, and lipstick. It's really cute. I love the gold and like the dark, almost like, well, it's even darker than cobalt blue. It's just a really like midnight blue, actually. It's a really cute bag. Oh, and the star. I love the star on the zipper. And the first thing I see is this Hey Honey Good Morning Honey Silk Facial Serum. This is what it looks like here and it says apply daily by itself for under your day or night cream excellent when used under makeup providing a smooth glossy appearance to your skin so you could actually kind of use this as a, a primer instead of whatever primer that you usually buy so that's pretty cool all right so the next thing is this mad lash black mascara by the balm actually i'm i'm starting to dig mascara samples. Um, I watch Crispy a lot. If you guys don't know her, she's an amazing makeup artist on YouTube and I will link her channel down below. But she had mentioned how she loves using sample mascaras because they just work better and they also dry out a little faster and so I really love to use them on my under eyes because I don't like the under eye um, lashes to be really clumpy. So I'm always a fan of these. Although I do get them a lot so I'm starting to like accumulate way too many mascaras so hopefully I won't keep getting mascaras but we'll see let's see what the wand looks like actually oh, oh there it is okay so it's got a really nice curve to it it's not too big it's it's long but it's not super thick I feel like a lot of the mascaras I've gotten lately have super super thick wands which is really hard to use when you're trying not to get mascara all over your eyelid and the next thing is this professional um, by Benefit. Let's see, I saw this on line, but it was gonna be in here, so I'm excited. It says Pro Balm to minimize the appearance of pores. So, that's what it looks like. It's a tiny little sample. I've heard really good things about this primer. Um, so I'm really excited to try it, actually. Okay. Okay, I've got this um, matte stick lipstick. Oh, I've got like, I got the mascara all over my fingers, nice. Um, it's this matte stick lipstick here by Absolute New York. And it is in the shade Dark Red. Nice. Okay, I have to open this. Oh, that was actually pretty easy. Usually when I twist, the wrapper does not come in that well. So that makes it super, super, ooh. There you go. Okay, so this is the shade here. I'll go ahead and swatch it on my hand. Okay, there it is. That's pretty. You know, actually um, have a lot of 
um, kind of blue based red lipsticks like this um, so we'll see how it compares um, but I I love red lipstick so that's always nice. next thing I have here is this Laka La & Co be lighter it is a uh, called preacher's daughter it's like a cream is it a cream highlighter maybe it's a cream highlighter or a cream eyeshadow but it says blighter i don't know i have no idea maybe you guys know better i kind of swatch that on my hand i don't know if you guys can see it i'm so fair that it makes this really hard Let's see if you can see it oh there you go that's a lot better it's a really really light pink cream shimmery shade I think it's a cream eyeshadow. I can't imagine putting it on as a highlighter. Well, if you're more tan than me, maybe it would work, but it's pretty. I'm excited to try that. All right, well, that was it for Ipsy. Let's go ahead and get to BoxyChow. Open up BoxyCharm. This is what it looks like on the inside here. Here's the handy dandy card that gives us all of the products and their retail value. And the front, it says Groovy Town. Let us take you down to Groovy Town. First thing I see here is a little, looks like a um, coupon for Marula Pure Beauty Oil. It says get 25% off your next purchase on marula.com. All right. <clears throat> I'll grab this first since it was right where my hand was. Okay, Makeup Geek. <laughs> Makeup Geek blush powder full size and is retail value of ten dollars oh, oh that is so pretty oh it's almost like a nude pink color oh this is so pretty i've actually been wanting to find a blush this shade in particular like i want something really really subtle and natural looking i feel like that's going to be perfect oh this makes me happy but yeah it's just really subtle you can see it right here. Really natural, kind of nude pink blush. I love that. Ah, so excited. Grab the next thing. I'll go ahead and grab this next. Let's see what this is here. It says it's Marula Pure Beauty Oil. It's a facial oil, actually. Let's see what this is all about. So, Marula Pure um, face oil. It's a retail value of $58. Ooh, um, that is spendy, but it actually looks pretty big. It's heavy. So let's see. It says, um, leaves the skin soft and plump with increased firmness for healthy, beautiful, age-defying radiance. A light and hydrating facial oil that absorbs quickly into the skin without a greasy afterfeel. Suitable for all skin types. So that's nice. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, it comes in a really nice little bottle here. It's it's glass. If you're clumsy like me, that's never good. But and it comes with a little dropper. Oh, it smells like it smells like tea tree oil, I think. So it definitely smells like essential oils, but I'm excited to try it. I'll put a little bit on my hand or my wrist probably because my hand has makeup all over it. And see how it feels once it's rubbed into the skin. It feels a little greasy. It's not too bad, but maybe if I check it in the next like couple minutes, it won't feel as greasy. But my skin definitely feels softer. Right the next thing in here, it looks like a palette. Oh, it's another Studio Pro palette. I love my other Studio Pro palettes, so. I think we got a Studio Pro palette in BoxyCharm like two months ago. And I still, I used it today actually. <laughs> That is so gorgeous. I am so excited about this. So I love wearing purples. There's three of them. Oh, they're so pigmented. My other Studio Pro palette, I love it. It's super pigmented. The color payoff is just incredible. And they're so creamy. Put these three down here a little further. Right there. Oh. I love this one so gorgeous and then it's got um three more darker shades down here i'll go ahead and swatch those ones as well just put them here so there they are like there's a nice kind of this one's almost like brown shimmery brown color so gorgeous i love this i'm super excited about this palette like 
I kid you not, I used this Studio Pro to go palette that um, I got in my BoxyCharm a couple months ago all the time. At Studio Pro palette is a retail value of oh, $49.95. Got two big expensive products in this box, which is awesome. The next thing I see in the box is this Bella Pierre Cosmetics Kiss Proof Lip Cream. Look at all the swatching on me. <laughs> it looks like a really pretty nude color. I love nude lipsticks. Like I literally could not have enough nude lipsticks um, because they're all kind of like slightly different shades. And I wear nude lipsticks the most out of any other color of lipstick because it's just a safe lipstick to go with. <laughs> My everyday go-to lip color is nude lipstick. So I'm always excited to get one. Excuse me for about 10 minutes while I try to open this packaging. go. I'll go ahead and swatch it on my hand. Okay, that is really pretty. So it is a little bit darker than my favorite BH Cosmetics liquid lipstick. It's got a little bit more pink to it than my BH Cosmetics one does. My BH Cosmetics one I think is slightly cooler, more like kind of gray based. Like I love that color. I'm so excited. So excited! That Bella Pierre Kiss, oh, yeah, Bella Pierre Kiss Proof Lip Cream is a twenty dollar. And the last thing in this box, it looks like is a crown brush. It's a C thirteen brush. Looks like a nice small crease brush. I cannot get this open. Ah, almost like a pencil brush but a little like slightly more fluffy so yeah this would be really really good for like a cut crease or doing your um shadow on your bottom lash line this crown brush pro detail crease brush is a 12.99 value another plus today my husband came home from work for lunch and made me a latte this is the way to my heart right here homemade lattes delicious. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing video. I will make sure and leave a list of all the products that I got down below and the retail value of all of the BoxyCharm products as well. And if you guys are at all interested in signing up for your own Ipsy or BoxyCharm, I will have links where you can just click on that and I'll take you right to where you need to go to sign up. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend and I will see you in my next video.